Hi everyone, I'm Bruno, or in the Playable Games community, I'm also known as Invincible, and this is the Playable Games Weekly Update video. Our mission at Playable Games is to create play-to-earn games that transport you to a different place, while directing the ownership, design, and economy of these games to the people who play the video game and to reward those players with in-game assets that they own. This week we'll cover Revan, our MOBA shooter game, and Dogs of War, our co-op survival game. Stay tuned to see what we've got. The Revan team is hard at work adding in additional content and details before the full release of the game. Remember, everything you see here is subject to change before the final version of the game. This week, the team passed some more of behind-the-scenes looks at the ongoing progress with the visual effects of a few weapons. And another update for the character skin we showed the last couple of weeks, this is the Hawk skin's latest pass, and it looks super clean. This here is the Ultra Spider skin in the crouched position aiming the Genesis rifle. I really like the emissive lights in this render. The scythe weapon attack VFX are heating up. The scythe is a close range submachine gun. It has a fast rate of fire. The spire is coming along as well. Check out these bolts of electricity arcing out from the muzzle. The spire is a long range sniper rifle that can be equipped with a longer scope than the assault rifle. It does lots of damage per shot, but has a slow rate of fire. This is an updated look at the super minion weapon attack visual effects. These are way cool. Let us know what's got you hyped in the chat below. Stay tuned to this weekly video for more information regarding Revan, our MOBA shooter game. Dogs of War is a survival game, and it's very early in the game's design still. But we can show you some more progress in Old Bull's pet project this week. Keep it in mind that this is subject to change drastically before the end of development. And remember that these dogs are the surviving warriors of the human race. Last week you saw the pug building a log house, and now you can see the pug cutting down the tree. I love the logger's outfit. Canada should be proud, eh? This dog of war is rummaging through this box looking for gear to survive the island. This dog of war has encountered a villainous cat. Stay alive, buddy. Just in case it goes south, your team could pick you up and evacuate you. Once you get to a safe area, the Dog Tour of War can patch you up. Remember to watch every week for more early looks at Dogs of War. You can trade Bull Token on Trader Joe's, L Bank, and Bitmart. Bitmart currently shows the price at .0006, or six hundredths of a penny. The volume of transactions is averaging over $250,000 per day this week, for a total of $1,752,716 in volume for the last seven days. The market cap is currently $1,171,852. There are 50,000 nodes for sale total, of which 4,379 nodes have been sold. Currently, 1,564 coins per node per day are distributed, and 45,621 nodes remain for sale. The current price for a node is $4,400, US and there are 21 nodes left at that price before it increases to $4,500 US each node. Remember, you can use Snowtrace to keep up with playable games on the Avalanche blockchain at your convenience. There are currently 1,216 wallets that hold very important bull passes. There are currently 2,156 wallets that hold playable games nodes. And there are currently 2,053 wallets that hold bull token. That's all the new info I have this week. Remember that our mission is to create play-to-earn games that immerse you in the experience, while allowing you to experiment by directing the ownership and design and economy of these games to the people who play those games and reward those players with in-game assets that they own. Please let us know your questions in the comments below for a chance to be featured in a future AMA video. I hope you all learned something this week during our recap, and if you did, please leave a like on the video to tell YouTube to share it with other likely viewers. Subscribe for more playable games content and hit that bell for notifications. Thanks for watching. I'm Bruno, aka Invincible, and I'll see you all again next week.